in the previous video we talked about what is business objects now in this video we will talk about what is object studio and how to create a simple object so object studio is used to develop and configure the business objects it captures the functionality of an application so that it can be used in the process studio let me show you how to create a simple object so to create an object you have to go to this studio tab and then come to this objects and then right click on this and here we have option to click on create object now you can see here we have a folder as well it means we can segregate our objects we can put our objects into a folder as per the projects if you're working on any projects you can put all those objects into one folder you can right click on this and you can create a group it means that a folder you can create here and then you can move all these objects in that you can also right click on this default and then click on create object here you need to enter that business object name so I'm going to put here object notepad because I'm going to start working with the notepad automation so this is our object name click next and click finish so you can see here we have created this notepad object and the icon of this object is different from the process right double click on this and you can see here this is the object studio there are two types of business objects in blue prism first internal business objects and second external business objects internal business objects or you can say like internal vbo's visual business objects internal business objects are ready-made objects that are ready to use and configure in object studio and external business objects are developed in object studio here you can see in this object studio we have left side same as process studio we have also stages here on the top we have option to run and here we have a workflow where we can design our objects we can create our business objects here we will discuss about what is the difference between process studio and object studio in the next video